Naron Lewis. Enjoy. We don't need no burdens. Incidental that the sound of music is from Princess Trinidad. <laughs> Probably should start the Princess said, What do you think about, <laughs> about being featured in this animation before we go to Christian? Are you surprised me? But this is very <laughs> good job. You know, <laughs> Nairon, you kill it. You kill it. You, know? <laughs> you are great. You are great. You know, it's flawless. It is also, also, yes, song written by me, yes, song with melody. By <laughs> <me>. <laughs> I'm sure you love it. 
Good job. Great job, Mary Ryan. <laughs> great, great. Thanks. Krista, what do you think? I I really I really enjoyed that. And it was funny because I was like, I, is this the person that created the animation that also sang the song? There was so much things going on in my mind. And I got really swept into the music. I was like, who wrote this? What is this? I, I can't wait to find out what's going on. Then when I saw the title, it said original song by Princess Trinidad. And I was like, what's going on here? So much goodness. Wow. So there's a little bit of a collaboration. Did you know this was happening, Princess? No. <laughs> I did. I did not, he never told me anything about this. I never know he was doing this. But this okay, so um, yeah. Can I can I ask you what was it like seeing your song animated and having well, animation put to it? I'm excited. I feel so happy. And what what um I like to see a youth when when an adult song is taken by a youth, you don't want anything better than this. You know, so congratulations, Naira. Thank you so much. <laughs> you know what I liked about this is that, well, you animated it for one. Animation for me is, is fi by far one of my most favorite forms of storytelling. It's just, it, it, it just, it knows, it knows, it, it's not limited. It can be whatever you want. It's a great form of expression. There is, it is a very hard trade or skill, sorry, to, to, uh, to learn unless you're built for it. You have the beginnings of being built for this. And the fact that you understand the narrative, obviously you chose the song. Why did you choose that song? Oh, I can't hear you, man. Is it just me? Like um, the reason I'm asking you, Nairon, we're not hearing you. The reason I was asking unmute him why. Nairon, I unmute your mic. Click on the mic. He's fixing it. There you go. There you go. Unmute. Sometimes it doesn't work. Are you good? Nairon? Okay, well, uh, we'll just move it along. Hopefully you can get that fixed. I, I just want to tell you, like, um, working in music videos and, and, and shooting skateboard videos when I first got out of theater and film school and, and uh, shooting bands, I always wanted to animate stuff. This is, I love animation. I, I love that you chose a song to give another voice to because animation is, vo is a voice, even though you were not... Um, you know, sometimes they're not voiced, like you didn't have any voice actors, you had a pre-recorded song, so you were animating to it, but because you had a feeling, which gave you a vision, which made you creatively, the fire within started percolating, you're like, I'm gonna do this, and this is what's gonna happen, and you used your hands, your mind, and your body to add to the song, which was already awesome, and then you put all this MSG over it and it becomes its own thing. Her song, which she didn't even know what it was, you did give new life to it. And that yeah, yeah. that right there, that show, oh, there you are. Why did you choose this song? Okay, well, um, I'd like to think the song chose me, first of all. Because... All right, you win every time. <laughs> I love this. Um, I actually work pretty closely with um, Princess Trinidad. Um, with her music and stuff. So whenever she does, you know, songs, she asks me to animate them. So I decided wow. to, you know, conveniently, this was the one that I, we were working on during the week of, you know, applying for the, you know, the whole talent must bust. I was like, you know, this, you know, it's kind of like a two birds with one stone kind of thing. But it was a really lo lovely song. It's probably one of my favorite songs by her currently because mm -hmm. it's so, you know, vivacious and, you know, Caribbean. That's even a thing to really call it. So, yeah. <laughs> And do you have any training with animation or this is just a hobby or you're starting to get into it? Where, where, what stage are you in? Um, before I graduated high school, I did some animation. I did two years of animation. I'm currently doing um, film production in college though, but I did two years of animation. I do it as like a, I wouldn't want to say a side practice because it's my bigger passion, but mm -hmm. I, I, I do practice it. I do practice it. 
Great, 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 great. Well, I like that you chose to do a mu music video approach as uh, as opposed to just voice acting. I some of my animation friends that like animation is a voice. Yeah. Right. So you it can come out and and the fact that you gravitated towards something that was already done and then put your own spin to it is great. Um, do you work with besides just people characters? Do you work with other other in your animation? I see a lot behind you right now. I see a lot of uh, caricatures and, and 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 drawings of. Do you work with uh, mostly humans, or do you do like human figures, or do you do other other types of styles of animation? Um, what what do you mean? I'm not sure I understand. Oh, okay. So like um, the style that like you you were using flash animation, right? Um, I was I actually did that in Premiere, actually. Premiere, okay, okay, yeah. man. Listen, you know what? You have a lot of potential. And you're the type of animator that they like. Right? And trust me, right now, trying to find an animator is really hard because animation production has gone through the roof because we can. they are now sending facial recognition from phones from voice actors like myself in the booth so that's speeding up animation process. I'd like to work with you and show you and with some of my animation buddies, like the top animators here in, in the country and in the city that make all your cartoons. Uh, they have a lot of programs for people like you and, and the, the woman that we just saw before here who are, who are just starting out going, hey, guess what? There's an easier way <laughs> by a <laughs> click of a button or something. It just does it. But you got to do all the work. So I would love to work with you. I, I like I just liked your take on things. And that just shows a whole vastness of untapped uh, imagination and stuff. You. If you, if you given access to these, to these tools, right. And because of this pandemic right now, they're giving this stuff away to, to help produce, uh, um, um, you know, some, some content and stuff for early childhood education. And because everyone's at home learning, so they could give you something and just go here, man, you, I saw what you did. I'd like to help you and that, that other woman make a sizzle reel so that you can, you know, and then take, take Princess Trinidad song, which is great. And then let's go for it. Let's make something and be like, hey, then you can put that on your resume. You float that around and go, this is what I do. And you make what's called a sizzle reel. Cause you got some potential, man. It's good. Good. Thank I want to work Thank with you, you too. Can I, Thank can, you. I Thank you. can I say something here? Can I say something here? Okay, princess. Okay, I did something for kids. Um, like the alphabet and um, all with the cow and everything. And I did it in Raga Soka. So it's a mixture between reggae and soca. So I created the beat also. So Nairon, coming to you <laughs> soon. <laughs> coming to you soon. Yeah, looking That's forward awesome. To it. <laughs> Want to see your vision on that one. Awesome. I, I love this. I love this. Congratulations, Naron. Thanks thank you, very thank much. You.